What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with some more Chainsaw Man Season 1, Episode 4. Now, before we get into anything with the episode, I do want to give a huge shout out to Stitched Down SD. I'll put a picture of their Instagram on the screen. I'm not paid for any promotions or anything like that. Uh, I was wearing one of their, I actually have a few of their hoodies, but I was wearing one of their hoodies in a Tokyo Revengers episode last year, and they saw that and decided to send me a free hoodie which is this beautiful green embroidered rock lee hoodie so again i'm not getting paid for any promotions i just wanted to personally give a huge shout out to stitch down thank you so much for the hoodie especially during this colder season i will be rocking it a lot it's one of my favorite boys from the show back to chainsaw man this one is called uh episode four this one is called rescue hopefully power minimum meowsy as well can get rescued uh you guys were informing me and letting me know a lot of details that i tend to miss or don't pick up such as denji's weird moral compass and how he is cool with sacrificing like dudes because he's like a you know he's a but like he really went out of his way to save the woman and the girl and the man and the girl like in certain situations like if it's just an average dude in a car you know who, who really cares like you guys told me he's the type of person to save a dog over a hundred people or, or an animal over which i'm like i personally somewhat agree with so i get that i get that to a t to an extent, I'm very excited to find out what happens. <sighs> a new ending. I like um, There's so much things I'm excited about. Remember, if you guys want to watch this episode full, uncut, as well as early access and uncut to the other shows I'm watching, One Piece, Kuroko no Basket, Assassination Classroom, check out that Patreon. Links are down below, like always. Other than that, make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe, click that notifications bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Let's hop right on into it. Chainsaw Man, Episode 2, Rescue. All right, starting the episode off in the woods with some pretty birds. Y'all ever had can pigeon punch? Oh, I mean, we do know that devils like human blood to recharge and re regenerate their energy and power. So I guess because there's no humans in the near vicinity, she just took what she can would kill anything that met her eyes. Like she said last episode, bears cows birds look how skinny little stray meow he is and so does meowzy so you find comfort in the blood just like you do for meowzy and they're both alive in the stomach thank the lord technically hopefully out of the stomach as well because denji just cut that boy's stomach wide open oh yeah a sea of intestines that's a fucking lot of them Oh, and she still didn't get to see his powers in action. I would love to have seen her reaction to it. Hey, we made a deal. No words even needed. Hey, you never know how far boobs can get you in life. You can slay some devils because of it. Your fucking life's mission is finally here. At least step one. He was like, this is all worth it. I almost died. Leave Meowzy. Okay, it was his arm. I was about to say, leave Meowzy the fuck alone. Well, there goes Denji's arm. Thank the Lord that can regrow. Oh my God! Look at those fucking nipples. Is this like the cow snake vagina devil? Worm. I don't know. Are you telling me we're gonna get a fight back to back? Has he lost too much blood? Is that why the chainsaw can't even fully come out? Squares up with one hand and a chainsaw coming out of his face. Who does this guy feel like he is? Denji! Yeah, you've never met an anime main... <laughs> you've never met an anime main character, though. No matter what it is, once they set their mind something, to something, they're going to continue with that pathway until it's achieved or accomplished <laughs> for that boy denji it's feeling tits oh my god yeah <laughs> come on everyone keeps hating on our reasoning It really make you feel like some of these swings have weight to them. Like, it really feels like there's some um. Did my man just chop it with his head? Was that a headbutt chop? Yeah, I got there. 
It's revenge that. Protect my family that. Blah, blah, blah. All you with your noble f***ing plans. I like that. We'll see whose resolve is stronger. <laughs> oh, this is so crazy. I love the way he looks deranged when he's like this. Oh my god, this animation is fucking flowing. This is giving me JJK vibes with how much it's flowing. They get, oh, Mappa, you're killing it. You gotta slip and slide all over the intestines. Jesus, oh my god. What are we pulling, some Hoth? Some uh, Empire Strikes Back gonna wrap the intestines around you? Knock you over, AT, AT, move with the... Imagine walking and seeing this fight. A worm pussy looking thing fighting a deranged chainsaw out of his head man on a pool of bat guts. I thought the headbutt was gonna work, but the tongue through the chest is even crazier. Aki? Makima? That has to be Makima. Oh, it is Aki. Come on. Come on. Okay, Megumi Fushiguro, you summoning the fucking devil dogs? What the fuck is that? That thing looks sweet. Leech devil. And she can talk? What Aki can summon? Oh my god, that is so badass. <laughs> the whole time the catch is like, what's going on? Good. Talk about a crazy episode immediately after a crazy episode. Oh, wow, yeah, just like naturally you grew all you needed is some extra blood, like, like devils, yeah. Yep. Again, to Aki it makes no sense, but it's a much deeper to Denji. I don't know, is, I, I forgot, I got knocked on my head, I don't remember. Oh, those are the people he saved last episode. Yes, that's amazing. He's already getting people wanting to thank him. <laughs> he saved four different people. Aki is going to be a real one here. Okay. What would that be, Aki? He seems like a logical, reasonable person, you know? I agree with that. I firmly agree with that. Like... Like, Aki's been a dick. He's been an asshole. Don't get me wrong. I'm not justifying him anything he's done, but it's coming from a place... I can't say of love, because obviously he doesn't love Denji, but it's not coming from a place of malice. Like, he doesn't want Denji here if he doesn't take it serious, because he doesn't want just some... He doesn't want Denji to die for no reason, for not a serious, actual, tangible goal. Obviously, Denji would would argue that his goal is more tangible than, than others, and, and is a as a as a fellow dreamer, you know, but uh, I'm really liking Aki's gray area right now because he realizes, he, he's he's pissed that Denji is covering and standing up for power, even though power, like, betrayed him and lied to him, but what he, he did go out of his way to save 3.5, he didn't go out of his way to save the car, dude, but you guys know what I'm trying to say. Like, he's doing the right thing, he's just a naive, unknowledged brat, which is kind of what he's saying. He's like, hey, you're doing the right thing, but you know nothing about the world you just stepped into. Just listen to me. You'll get some apples, and you'll get to live. So, I like Aki a lot, and I know you guys said you like him a lot. So, so far, and the Fox Devil looks amazing. Oh yeah, even if it's just the slightest bit more flexible, the slight it is a hundred percent Denji's influence, a hundred percent, and I love it. I don't know if that look by Makima was like, she's happy he's being more flexible and that Denji has good influence, or if she's not happy about it. I still know nothing about Makima's personality, if she wants Denji to succeed, if she, like, I don't, I need to know more. Gotta make some fresh Joe in the morning, get yourself alert, I get it. I don't drink coffee, but all my friends do. I don't know why, but they're making this shit look real nice and crisp. Like, that's the best looking anime coffee I've ever seen. And tell me why sitting on the that little porch with a newspaper and a cup of joe sounds like an amazing time right now. Maybe some Marlboro. I don't smoke, so I don't know, you know. 
Ah, and that boy Denji is here. A goat. <laughs> Gotta get the signature man bun. I don't know. I could have a whole slice of life show with just Aki doing his day-to-day day -day activities. Keeping the room clean, doing some laundry. That's some aggressive knocking. That's power, isn't it? Are you serious? Power and Meowzy in this? This is like a 500 square foot apartment. What? See, she's saying it's because I trust you more than anyone else, but it's like... I don't know. I don't think it's a punishment. I do think she trusts him, and maybe that was just manipulation to say, I don't know. I have no idea. I just cannot imagine us three living together under the same roof. This is the first time Denji and, and Aki are like working together just because of how despicable power is. Look at their faces. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm telling you, whether it's Slice of Life, whether it's whatever, I could watch this man Aki and the rest of them do whatever. Can't believe she just starts raising hell. That's like you. Aki's having to go through it. You shit devil. <laughs> hey, we still didn't we still didn't do our deal yet. You have earned three squeezes. Okay. It's a specific ratio for how much work you put in. Yup, one for the rescue of Mousy. Second for slaying the bad devil. This is the best day of his life. Look at him. He's like, oh, he's like, I will do this work unlimited. This is what I get from it. This is. She's an angel. Don't end it here. No. Oh, this is the new ending. Okay, let's watch this. I'm so mad. The episode ended right there. I want that forever. Oh, oh, okay, power. What are you feeling like? I love all these different outfits she's wearing in the bottom. I love the red emphasis as well. Like the fully red background. See, like, this is why I love endings and openings. Creatively, music-wise, visually, everything. This is so much different than last week's. Look at all her different outfits. This is fucking amazing. Okay. That was crazy. Okay. So... I'd say the biggest thing I want right now in terms of personal showing in the show is info. I know that sounds weird because the pacing has been so immaculate. We've already had, and we're four episodes in, and we've already had like low-key three really good fights, which is crazy. So the fact that that is what's going on, I need I need to know Aki's backstory. We got a little bit of powers, a little bit of Denji's. I need to know Makima's. I need to know the names of the rest of the experimental squad unit four. I need to know more about them. I need to know more about devils and the world building in its entirety and history, lore. I need to know a lot of different things. But in terms of this episode and in its entirety and its singularity was amazing. Shouts out to Meowzy and Power for being alive. Shouts out to Denji for fucking being deranged, going after that leech devil. Um, because the leech devil was going to kill Meowzy and Power and we needed to. We couldn't even fully kill it. We were low on blood, so the chainsaw couldn't fully come out of our head. And then Aki had to use the Fox Devil. Who I was like, oh, this Fox Devil's talking, but it's because they made a contract. And Aki gives it blood and, and flesh and life, which is crazy to think about. I wonder if there's any other contracts or he's made with devils or what other devils there are. Uh, I know I compared Aki to Megumi of JJK beforehand, but now I really have to because, uh, you know, the devil dogs, like Megumi can summon cool ass looking fucking aw, oh, but he's not summoning them. Aki's, you know, these are, it's completely different, but this is so cool. I love the actual look of the fox devil. Um, the look of the leech devil is fucking... Ugh. Shouts out Makima. Shouts out to our living situation. We need to get a new apartment. My man is not making enough money for what he has to go through. Uh, shouts out to Power letting us fondle her chest. But that our efforts made it, <laughs> made it possible. That was fucking hilarious uh all in all great episode love the fights love the animation so so much love how even though it's this most slight to the point where aki's not even gonna 
acknowledge that he's changing. We are getting character development for him. We're getting character development for power. We're getting character development for Denji. It's not like super. It's kind of like show not tell, you know. You kinda, and I love that. I love it. It's very subtle. Very subtle. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Check out that Patreon for the full uncut versions. Again, huge shout out to Stitch Down uh, for the free hoodie. I appreciate you immensely. Uh, don't forget to drink some water. Sell some when you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace out.